What's up, people? Afro Blade Master here for a 10 death challenge of Ghosts and Goblins. I was about to, I was about to be like, You gotta be freaking kidding me! Because I've been trying to get this game to work for like 20 minutes now. And yes, I am playing this on my old NES. Which, luckily, I have an NES, Ma an NES Max for, so. You know, I have not practiced this game at all, just like Castlevania. So, I'm prepared for these deaths to happen rather quickly. Especially since this game is like a two hit you're dead rule. Oh, there's the first hit. Oh, that was close. Uh, oh, that was close. Come on. Devilish bastard. Yes! Ha 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 ha! I kicked his ass! Wow, I, wow, I'm better at this game than I thought I was. Seriously, I thought it was going to be freaking horrible. Armor! Upgrade! Oh, hello, what's this? Uh, I'm not sure what that, I'm not sure what that did. Oh, well. See now. Oh, it's points. Okay. Ow! Freaking prick. Right in front of the freaking boss, too, and I wanted that item. That's one! Oh, let me grab my freaking pen. Yes, and every time you die, it just scrolls by, telling you, like, so you can look at all the stages you gotta do. It's kind of like a taunt, but, you know, yeah. And it looks like my NES Max isn't going to help me at all, because, okay, now, you see, this is me holding down the turbo button. And this is me attacking normally. Like, just tapping the button really fast. Freaking ghosts. The two! His ah ha 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 Almost immediately after recording, I start like I restarted. Like I didn't record it, but like I just started playing again, and I got up to and I kicked Medusa's ass in that like when I was playing like off camera. That was just a points joke. Now for a boss. Ow. Ow! I don't care if I got a game over. Let me just continue. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Oh, well. And I was expecting this video to be a lot shorter than Castlevania anyway. And since it's an, and since it's an actual NES game on an NES instead of on a Wii, it should be really quick to render and that zombie dropped an item that I do not oh, I didn't want the freaking torch. I'd rather have long range than just a Crappy weapon, and what the hell is that? Oh, hey, I killed it one hit. Nice. Oh, wow, that was close. Oh, 
great points, not an I not healing or armor. This is what I really want. This guy just dropped points. Well this guy dropped. Points! I don't want points! I want I want armor! I want not death! A knife will do! Oh wow, that was really freaking easy. Armored up! Somehow getting, getting a key regenerated my armor! And now we're on stage two! This stage is as far as I've ever gotten. And it looks like it's about as far as I am gonna get. <laughs> but yeah, like, um, by the way, it does this every time you die, you can't skip it. Uh. Excuse me. But yeah, back when I used to watch the Irate Gamer, I watched his review on this game. And I was thinking, ah, oh, there's. And he, like, I just remember, like, hearing the line that says, you can't get past the first stage without cheating. Like, you know what? I think I'm gonna. Not, I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get this on an emulator just so I. Just so I can get past the first stage without cheating. And I did. And I. Whoa! Number five. I kicked stage one's ass, to be honest. <laughs> but then again, that was on an emulator. And yes, and like, and plus, um, I'm pretty sure I mentioned it a few times before, but like, you know, I don't mind like, I don't mind emu I don't mind using emulators. It's just that I would much, much rather play a game on the system it was meant for. Rather than on, like, rather than on a computer. Okay, good. It starts me from freaking stage two. I was going to be angry if it didn't. I was gonna be, I was gonna be even angrier if I freaking accidentally hit um, <laughs> start again. Damn you, Imps! Ha ha ha! Hey, yes! I be victory! Ah, these guys are freaking... Hard to kill. Yeah. Ah! That's seven. Well, this just shows the freaking. Well, at least it shows where you are in the checkpoint. Like, exactly where you are in the freaking stage. So you can judge how much you got left. That was kind of a dick move. Okay, that was a cheap one, but it still counts. I was seriously thinking about making it so fault so enemies knocking you into pits doesn't count. You know, after that whole Medusa incident. But I decided that'd be the coward's way out, so. Okay, I shouldn't count that, but I'm going to. That was death number nine. One more death, and I gotta stop the video. Damn it! <laughs> okay, that was way off. To that was way out of sync. Oh well. Owie. Okay, that'll- okay, 
that does it for the 10 death challenge. And you know, I, th okay now, um, yeah, a full like five, si wow, a full six minutes, seven minutes shorter than the last one. Oh, five, because there's only 15 minutes of gameplay. Approximately. Well, anyway, I'm just going to continue playing while I talk, um, um, I, act like, um, I was actually thinking, um, okay, now, I have, like, I have two NES games that I want to do for this. The first two Ninja Gaiden games, and I actually have them for my NES. But I was thinking, um, what other, what games do you guys want to see for, for a 10 death challenge? I, I, and, I know you guys are going to come up with some real sadistic titles for me to, for me to play in the 10 death challenge. And, that's what I'm looking for, like, stupidly hard and frustrating games to play to see how far I can get before I die ten times. Uh, <clears throat> so, yeah. Like, um, like, um, like, the issue with my GameCube actually wasn't really that big of an issue at all. Like, I thought a wire in it got knocked loose or something. But, a, but a pen, but like a, when I actually like unplugged everything and made sure everything was all safe and clear, apparently when I, apparently like uh when my GameCube came, like when I unplugged my GameCube trying to, I can't remember what I was trying to do, but um I, but I pretty much dropped my GameCube, and apparently like a freaking piece of paper, a freaking piece of paper floated. Like somehow wafted into it, and when I, so when I plugged it in, it interrupted the connection, and that's that was literally the entire freaking issue. So I'm an, so I'm a freaking idiot when it comes to my game. I opened it up and looked and like looked at all the wires for freaking nothing. And yes, I do actually have a Nintendo screwdriver. So after putting my GameCube back together, I can't seem to find it. I think the knife is actually a little weaker, but oh well. Most of these enemies only take like one or two hits anyway. Um, let's see. What else did I want to say? Uh, but yeah, it's just a little, I guess, just a little bit of like, like Twitter-worthy stuff. I don't actually ever go on my Twitter account, so I don't say this there. So, which is why I don't say this there. But um, yeah, my chair broke last night. Seriously, like I was like um, like I was. I, I was actually playing freaking Maple Story, and um, like my um, hat, like I have my phone on like a little, like I had my phone on like this little stand by my computer desk. It's actually where I put most of my stuff, the stuff that I carry around with me whenever I go out. You know, like wallet, keys, various jewelry that I wear. Pretty much just like a necklace, a little bracelet and uh, a ring like um my phone was there and it started to ring so I reached over for it like I leaned over to grab it and my chair broke so like right now I'm con like I kind of have the downstairs I kind of have the computer chair from the computer downstairs until I get my own or until I buy a new computer chair and it really sucked, and not, I really didn't want to, I was, I really, this really sucks, because I was actually planning on buying a tablet with this week, with this week's paycheck. Ah. Yeah, like, um, yeah, I don't know if you guys, I know some of you guys might know this, but I actually do a lot of doodling. And, um... I mean, I have like a like two freaking thick notebooks filled with doodles. I and I figured, you know what? 
to save to save to save me a step because whenever I find a doodle that I think is really good, or whenever I make one that I think is really good, I always like I normally like uh use this scanner I have and like upload it to, and like scan it to my computer and like upload it to like Facebook or something. But um, I figured you know, I might as well freaking just cut out the middleman and buy a freaking tablet. I mean, not like a really expensive one since I'm not an actual freaking artist. As far as drawing goes, I can't draw to save my freaking life. As those of you who have my Facebook or I have linked to my Facebook on Skype know. Because I know a few people from Brennan and Friends are on my subscriber list now. And thank you guys for subbing. Like, I'll... Like, uh, if I like if I haven't subbed to you yet, I apologize. Like, um, anyway... You know what? This video's been going on for far too freaking long. It ended like ten minutes ago. It ended like five, six minutes ago. <laughs> anyway, you guys have you guys have heard me complain and blah blah blah. And this is one of the legendary demo reels. Yeah, that was a free. Yeah, like uh, you know, like you know how like in the like seriously like um, that's seriously as bad as the freaking Ghostbusters demo reel. Like I've played, I've uh, like I haven't actually played it, but I've seen a few reviews on it. And in the demo reel for for one of the Ghostbusters games, like literally, they're just running straight and shooting. This one is not even freaking running. <laughs> anyway, this video is way too freaking long. I'll see you guys next time. This is that for Blade Master logging off.